Uh, sorry, I've not done a video for quite a while. I uh, do apologise. I've had uh, a lot of things going on this year, and um, I've recently uh, I've lost my brother-in-law, and I was really close to him as well. And uh, he was into the model trains, die-cast models. He used to go to shows with him. Been on settled to Carlisle Railway with him. He's he's just like a brother to me, and I just uh, he's been ill quite a while and uh, recently passed away so it's been tough this year amongst other things as well so um well i just thought i'd show this set i got this set about three or four months ago and i've been after it for a long time it's a flashman 1885 luxury express train and this has been professionally converted to digital it's an absolutely amazing set it's about i think it's about 87 88 this set Probably a bit later, maybe not 100% sure. The box is quite worn, and I'm going to run it with these uh, similar coaches from Tricks. There, we're a very similar sort of coach, similar era. But I'll just get this sh this out of the box just to show how beautiful it looks. Yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of beautiful detail on these coaches. The paintwork and everything's brilliant. Windows, you can see all the gold edging around the windows and the way the some of the windows are open slightly. Just superb, I absolutely love the actual uh, the detailing on these coaches and the colour, that chocolatey brown sort of uh, with the red striping. In fact, I think it's red, there might be something else in there as well. And the dining car, it would have been a really luxurious train this. Would have had crystal chandeliers and mirrors and all sorts in that dining car. Like the Orient Express. And you've got the baggage car, which has got sliding doors, really nice. But what's really nice is the engine. The engine is stunning. Absolutely stunning. It's got high quality motor in there as well. It's not the standard Fleischmann one either. It's a much better motor. Not the pancake ones, but um, I can't remember the make of it. But there's, there's another specialist manufacturer that make motors in Germany. I forgot the name of them. Anyway, I'm going to get this running. Pull it out of station. Got a couple of uh, shots of it running around the layout. I have got some more stuff to show as well. I've got quite a lot of stuff that's been in storage and I've not really uh, shown or got out or used yet and when I say new stuff I mean it's old some of it's old it's just new to me alright thanks for watching